morning everyone oh it's hot it's hot i've been rushing around it's nearly 30 degrees we've just had some rumbles of thunder as well so fingers crossed the weather's gonna stay good it didn't come to much so i'm hoping it's gonna be okay anyway it's going away week i've been talking about this for a couple of weeks now leaving little hints so I'm all packed and ready to go. I'm very excited and we're going to spend three days in the Cotswolds. I've got a list of places that I want to visit. I think Vista's going to be one of them. I'm going to have a shopping day at Vista. Yeah, super excited about it. The hotel looks nice, so we'll see, won't we, when we get there. Obviously, I'll give you a tour and a look round, but at the moment I am dripping. I purposely had this uh, Lily Silk shirt in my mind for going away in because I thought the windows will be down if it's hot. Silk, it keeps you cold, doesn't it? And I have been dying to wear this Lily Silk shirt. I've paired it with white shorts today. It's just nice, casual, easy. Um, I'll show you actually right now. Let's take you off. So here I am, all packed. Dee's got that half, and we've got the small case as well for bits and pieces. Let me just put my slides on. I am literally too hot to be worrying about what's on my feet. These slides are from June, they're quite old, but I love them. They were worth every penny. I'm thinking about getting a tan pair. Yeah, so this is the look. Very nautical. This is how I'm going to turn up in the Cotswolds. So comfortable. Shorts are Ralph Lauren. I've got a little bit of um, tan on the legs. The good old Saint-Tropez. Don't use it anything else. I must probably do some of that actually while I'm there. I'm hoping to take some pictures and get some content, do some bits. I'm excited. Anyway on that note i'm gonna go finish packing and i'll join you on the journey arrived we're staying at the George in Shipton upon Stow I'm pretty sure it is this is our room number three let me show you it's a vast room really big as I was just saying today, it's a shame though, there's not one wardrobe. But other than that, it's beautiful. There's our hanging space. It's a shame that that's not a wardrobe. But other than that, it's really lovely. We're staying right in the little village, not out in the wild, because 
I just fancied that. I thought for the price of this place and for where it was, perfect for what we want. Some lovely details in the room. The bathroom is gorgeous. So you've got a really large bathroom. Roll top bath. It's really lovely. I'll leave all the details linked below actually and uh, I'll give you some feedback on what it's been like this day. Really, really pleased. Time for a cup of tea. Morning everyone. We slept like logs, didn't we? Yes, we did. The bed is lovely. We, we didn't do anything when we... Uh, after we arrived yesterday, we just completely conked out. It's really lovely here though. The staff have been very helpful. It's nice and spacey. Um, the shower is amazing. And yeah, just having the morning cuppa. We're gonna get dressed in a minute and go and have some breakfast. Um, and then see what the day brings. I've got my new livery pajamas on this morning. And they're perfect, perfect. They didn't even crease in the case. Very, very comfortable. Very lady of the manor. I think this camera is a little bit wonky, you know. You said it was wonky, didn't you? That's a bit better. The, the floors in this hotel are really uneven because it's such an old building. But it's really lovely. The sun's shining. We're going to go and have a lovely day. So I'm going to get ready and I'll show you what I'm wearing today. All ready to go for a day out. I don't know how long the hair's going to last because it's so hot out there. I think uh, the makeup is going to melt off the face most probably. <laughs> But who cares, who cares? I'm gonna have some fun today. I'm looking forward to uh, hopefully going to Dalesford. And there's a couple of reclamation yards that I want to look at. So uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. We had a lovely breakfast. I will film breakfast tomorrow. Um, I just felt such a mess after getting caught in that rain yesterday. I thought I'd wait and spruce myself up a little bit. But anyway, this is what I'm wearing today. The m and dress, it's lovely this dress, light as a feather, perfect for our 30 degree weather. I've got my usual tan shoes on, but I do have a pair of flats in my bag. I've brought the Teddy Blake bag and trust me, it's full. I've got um, cameras in there, flat shoes, drinks, it's got the kitchen sink in it so that timing couldn't have been more perfect. I was going to bring a basket bag but they're all up in the loft still and I thought no I wanted to take the Teddy Blake bag. Anyway I'm going to get going because Dee's waiting for me. But that is the look. Here's to a good day. We've just arrived at Dalesford, so I'm going to have a good nose round. It looks lovely already. Lovely even from the outside. I'm going to buy lots of plants. You're not. <laughs> Dee says the garden's like a jungle, but we might sneak one in. No, we won't. Yeah, we will. We start then. <laughs>
thousands of different reserves to choose from. Everything you could want. How pretty is this table? I'm definitely going to shoot upstairs and have a look at the table linen. Absolutely beautiful. This blue, nineteen pounds for that one. What to buy, ladies? What to buy? Oh, it's actually lovely in the green as well. Twelve tiny quail eggs. There's just so much here, it's not just gardens. I want everything. <laughs> Long deal. Oh, I like that. That is beautiful. £24 a plate. Little bit expensive for me, but still nice. If I had all the money in the world, definitely. But it's certainly something different. Ah, oh, all the cabbage. This is lovely. actually go nice with my green and lemon theme on the garden table. Thinking about that one. Big lemon trees. drive we came from Dalesford I didn't buy anything there I didn't buy anything at all it was just a little bit too pricey and I just didn't love anything enough if I loved something enough I would have bought it but it was lovely having a look round I've wanted to go there for ages and uh, they had some really quirky stuff I should have bought a plant really but I didn't I might go back I might go back tomorrow I'm gonna to think about it but right now I've come to station mill antiques um, I'm always seeing this place on YouTube and I thought I want to go there so we're gonna go and have a look round it's so hot so hot it is currently 29 degrees 29 degrees I'd be moaning if it was raining I'm not going to moan about the weather it's so beautiful here how many of you have been to the Cotswolds I'd like to hear and what your favourite places are but just driving around is really lovely beautiful anyway let's go and have a look around the antiques place
everyone's out and it's so warm it's a lovely evening look at this old church everywhere is just like this beautiful little streets might have a little browse in all the shops tomorrow I think and there's so many bars been on a bit of a pub crawl in all the gardens there's so many pubs aren't there within 100 feet of each other yeah so many pubs you get more pubs here than you do in London but it's such a lovely evening it's nice to sit out in so I've got my water He's having a nice pint in peace. And everywhere's really busy, I will say. That's it for the end of the first day on our holiday. We've had a little pub crawl. Yes, we have. We've been to some really nice places today. Yeah, it's really been lovely. What do you reckon the temperature is? It's so warm, it's got to At be. At the moment. 20 degrees 23 I'd say I reckon it's about 20 degrees now and it's just such a lovely evening looking forward to tomorrow and what tomorrow brings I'm gonna get back to the room now and get the jammies on and chill out and watch some TV because I am shattered We've just stopped off to take some photos. Look at the scenery, it's beautiful. There's the old tripod. Can you hear the bird song? Wow. Already now, brother. Believe me, these roads are so country and they drive like crazy. This is the outfit of the day that I didn't film this morning. It's now half past five. Time has just flown by. We was driving round the villages, just having a mooch about in the countryside. And I thought, I didn't share what I was wearing today. It's been so hot so hot today another near 30 degrees i think but yeah this is the dress the uh broderie anglaise dress from Denmark. i love it it's not been too hot either it's actually been quite nice to wear something white um yeah we've we've just been moved We've just been mooching around the shops and taking it easy. We just thought we'd have a full day off today. We're gonna we're going to um, have something to eat soon and go from there. But yeah, I've worn flat shoes uh, purely because it's just too hot for heels. I cannot be prancing about in heels in this weather. Too hot for me. I'm not complaining about the heat, but just too hot for heels. The hair is <laughs> very windswept, very windswept from being in the car. But I love this dress and I love the length of this one as well. Right, I'm going to go back downstairs. I'm going back downstairs now and uh, go from there, see what the day brings. <laughs> Good morning everyone. This is the last morning at the George Townhouse. I was a very bad vlogger yesterday and Dee had a migraine so we had a really easy day yesterday but this is the last morning I've got my cup of tea it's really quiet it's about seven o'clock in the morning it's really sunny already and uh, I just wanted to finish up this morning down here in the garden this is where I've come for my cup of tea 
in peace. There's not a soul around except for a few cars whizzing past. But this is the garden that we've uh, spent the evenings and it's been really lovely. We've got an exciting day today. We're going to Vista for a shopping day. So I am excited. It's been a while, hasn't it, since I've been to Vista. Um, yeah, so we're gonna pack up and have some breakfast and go to Vista. But there's still one more place that I want to visit. We're packing up here today and Dee's booked us in for another hotel stay. So we're actually going to um, a spa hotel as an extra. We, we've enjoyed it so much we've booked an extra day. So really happy. It's not time to go home yet. My dog sitters are okay with that as well. So it's all worked out really well. And I'm looking forward to seeing the next hotel we're gonna stay in. It's only for one night. I'm gonna show you around in this little garden off of the bar. They've been really good with the food for me as well. With the menu, they've catered for me. I would recommend this place. The staff are lovely. They're friendly, we've had chats. It's been really, really nice really nice so this is the garden and I've wanted to film down here uh, a few times but it's always really busy and you can see me in the mirror there uh, yeah really busy and I've not been able to film but yeah it's, it's been nice I love those mirrors on the wall. Me and Dee were saying we'd like to do something like that in the garden. That would make my garden look so much wider as well. Yeah, you can hear traffic now here at the back, but you can't hear any of in our room. It's been really nice. The bed has been good as well. Dee's not ached or anything. Everything has been lovely. Yeah, so I'm sorry about yesterday. All you got was me getting ready and what I was wearing. And that was it. We, we just took it really easy. But today there will be a lot more filming. We'll, I'll take you in the shops. Don't know if I'm going to buy anything. We'll see. We'll see what's there. All ready to go all packed all done now i'll be sad to leave i would definitely definitely come back here i have thoroughly enjoyed it the people have been lovely they've got all the time in the world for you as well they'll stop and chat it's it's just been lovely i would definitely come back anyway outfit of the day the most comfortable one because we're off to Bista and I just want to be comfortable shopping. It's not all about the looks today, ladies. But anyway, it's so hot as well. It's difficult to know what to wear and try and look half decent in this weather. So I've worn this H&M shirt. You've seen it loads of times, but it's just so loose cool to wear um trousers these are trousers these are actually balkan i've had these a good few years now but they're very similar to the cigarette trousers from h m that would be white they're actually nylon identical so i would recommend those but yeah that's the look today i've got the um lupe lupe these are called from uh is it Jones? June from June. I am seriously thinking about getting another pair of these sandals. That was the thing that I wanted to point out. This carpet is so thick, you can see your footprints in it. It's honestly, it's luxury for what we've paid for. Uh, 70 pounds a night, this room. I, I couldn't recommend it more, honestly. Yeah, so this is the look. 
nice and comfortable these headache is not too bad thank goodness um, and hopefully we're gonna have a nice day we'll be moving on to another hotel just for tonight we'll be leaving early tomorrow though so I don't know how much content I'm gonna get in but I'm looking forward to it it's been a proper little adventure anyway let's get going these waiting downstairs so let's have a nice day shopping hopefully i'll find a good bargain today hopefully speak soon it's very busy i don't know if you can see me but it is really busy we're heading straight into gucci someone with smaller feet than me they are tiny They're a size two. That's really nice. Two hundred and twenty five. This is really nice. I quite like this one. Two hundred and eighty five again. Super, super busy, but it is a beautiful day. Might have to go and pretty manger for a cup of tea. Candle. Super Sauchi looking at the sunglasses. They're nice. Trying on a belt in Holland Cooper. I really like it. I, I like this brand. Really, really like it. I've been wanting to try some of the uh, Holland Cooper for some time. Really, really nice. I'm just wondering if that would still fit with my jeans. If it was much lower, 
it's beautiful quality. This is the belt that's going to last you for years. I'll have to put you down. Just trying on one of the iconic blazers, but um, this is a 10. So for reference, ladies, Holland Cooper comes up a little bit small. But yeah, that is beautiful colour. I'm not sure about the length on me. It's making my legs look a little bit short. Yeah, this is the size 12. It fits perfect. It actually feels lovely on. It's very weighty. This would be good for winter. You could wear this on cold days, no problem. I'm just not sure about that length where it's hitting my leg. If that was a little bit shorter, look. That would be the difference. But yeah, I love the belt and I love the slides. Just in Ralph Lauren now. Dee's bought some bits and I bought something, so it's all good. Spotted this, I think it's beautiful. You know how much I love a shirt dress. I didn't realise that my shirt was still available. They've got it in here, but I can never find it online. I don't know why that is. There you go, ladies. It's a pista. Oh, there's a little bit of love here. Oh, my goodness. It feels beautiful. I don't think they've got my size, though. This is a beautiful dress, £160, that's a UK 10. Love the sleeve detail, it's beautiful. Very tempted. Might have to have a try on ladies. Heading straight, straight to Chloe now. It's a beautiful day, so hot. But can we just take a look at the uh, queue for Dior? When people have got so much money, I just cannot, even if I had the money, I wouldn't buy from there. Just too expensive. These are beautiful, we're in Chloe, they are £255, I think when the Holland Cooper ones are 85 alone, it just makes a better buy to me, but I do love the Chloe brand, these are very nice as well. 475. Oh, 
Look at this, beautiful. It's as light as a feather. Beautiful. Heading into coach. Excited. Right, we're all done. We've had a good day. We have. We've had a lovely day. Anyway. Dee certainly enjoyed it. I'll show you some of the bits that Dee's bought when we get home. But I did well. We've both done well. It was a lovely day. And now we're going to head back to the next hotel that we're just staying in for tonight. And then we'll be heading home. But yeah, that was a really nice little shopping trip. Oh yeah. It's very, very hot. So hot. It's difficult to film in this heat as well. And all the people, it was so busy. Everywhere was absolutely ram-packed and you just can't get your camera out like that. It was difficult. But anyway, I'll share with you what we bought later. It was really nice. Dee's first visit to Bista, I don't think it'll be the last either. We've arrived. Here it is. Look at this. <gasps> Stunning. <sighs> they even got their own little entrance hall. Wow. Let me show you around. So we have a sitting room. 
Fireplace. That's a lovely little fireplace, actually. Mm. And you've got this lobby. Look at the bathroom. <gasps> Look at this. This is marble. So you've got all your wardrobes and everything here. Tea, coffee station. It's perfect. Then, this is the bedroom. So you've got dressing table. Do you know it's really odd I said today? I had this dressing table when I was young. It's by Danks, I'm pretty sure. But ours, my one was teak. See the teak running along the bottom? Mine was just all teak. It's exactly the same. You've got a vanity mirror inside. Like that. And then you had to draw for all your makeup. And I must probably made a right mess of that. But it's a real throwback to see this piece. Lovely bed, but the finale, look, we've got our own courtyard. We've got our own courtyard. Oh, it's just absolutely beautiful. This is just stunning. This obviously leads into the gardens, I think. Let's see what's beyond this gate. Oh, it doesn't. No, it doesn't open. But how stunning. Look at this marble table. It's not marble, mosaic table. Absolutely beautiful. And I'm only here until 7.30 tomorrow morning. I'm not impressed. I'm not going to want to go home. That bathroom though, look, this is all glass. Glass wall. All cosy. I'm just about to make the most of that bath. I am absolutely shattered after today. It's going to take a long time filling this one up. Just having a little look around before I leave. I'm gutted that we're not staying here. Extra time, look, it's beautiful. And I wanted to go out in the gardens. Oh, wow. I don't want to go home. I don't want to go home. <laughs> and get some cow juice. Anyone got a black pen? 
Okay. I want to put my name on there. The queue's actually not too bad. It's gone down within about 10 minutes. So think about it if you're ever in, coming this way. It doesn't take long to go down. When we come yesterday, it was like five times the length of this queue. But it, it's, it's not been too bad to queue at all. I hope there's going to be some bits left when we get in there. Bull beans, carrots and beetroot so far. I've got my little basket at the ready. Mm. I love your gloves. She's having a look at the pork pies. It's very cramped. On the way home now. home this is all the loot um i was going to unbox this when i got home with you but i've been editing the film and i've realized this is most probably one of the longest films i've ever put on youtube so apologies for that ladies i hope you had a couple of cups of tea while watching um so i'm gonna do this unboxing in the next weekly vlog i've got a fashion video going out next and then you'll get the unboxing in the weekly vlog um yeah so home i've washed my hair uh, who's washing their hair all the time at the moment because it's just so hot i am um it's very stormy here in essex very stormy and yeah I had the best time, the best time, and I'll have a little chat about it when uh, I do that weekly vlog, which won't be long, It'll be about eight days, nine days. Can't wait to share with you all the goodies that I got anyway, especially at Vista. Um, I hope you enjoyed the film, I'm sorry it's so long. I've cut that film down as much as possible, I could have put so much more in. I did debate on um, doing it in two parts, but I felt that it just wouldn't gel, if, just wouldn't present well, if, if that makes sense. It just wouldn't look right, I don't think. It had to be the holiday. And uh, yeah, it was great. I thoroughly enjoyed that holiday. I'm already planning to go back. I can't wait to go back to the Cotswolds. I absolutely loved it. Anyway, as always ladies, please give a thumbs up for the film, that makes all the difference to me. And if you're new here, please subscribe. My name's Laurie by the way. Um, I'm a mature woman here on YouTube, sharing fashion, beauty and lifestyle. And I'll see you in the next one. Love to you all.